Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 41, and this is war number 10. And we're going against an alliance called Aggressive Attack. Okay, we're going to see what defense you guys have. Let's take a look at who you've banned. I hate you. Uh, you banned Gallon. Um, don't really care about the other ones, but yeah, you banned Gallon. All right, uh, so let's see what you have in store. Why did you ban Gallon? Let's uh, take a look here. Oh, that's why you banned Gallon. So first off, we've got Nimrod. Okay, he's got armor up, so we know how that goes, but um, I can bring Hulkling uh for these fights as well let's we'll keep going super scroll um do i want to take super scroll um i can if i if i uh bring hulkling um i should be able to take that fight as well yeah let me see strike counter when they have an armor up. Okay. We'll special lock them. Is, oh man, is Hulkling... I always forget. I think Hulkling is power burn, but is he also power lock? I'll find out. Because um, I always forget. I'll just have to look it up. Um, but Hulkling might be able to take these three here. All right, let's see. Okay, and we've got um, Omega Sentinel. Gallon would be great for that one, but I can bring in the Overseer. He should be uh, okay for this one. I just have to remember to fight her properly. Oh, they didn't put anybody on that node, so I don't have to worry about Hulkling for that node. And then we have, oh boy, we've got, um, I hate fighting Warlock. I really do. And I may bring Claire. I may bring Claire. So um, Hulkling, the Overseer, and Claire. That that might work. Um, Mangog, uh, I think one of our. Let me see. Hold on. Let me let me look real quick here. I think they're already talking. Okay, okay, okay. So I don't have to worry about Super Skrull. Uh, one of my alliance mates is going to take him. So I can bring Hulkling in if I want to. Um, but I don't have to worry about that guy. Uh, the Overseer, I can take uh, Omega Sentinel. And... Claire to uh, finish my path. Mangog would be for my other uh, alliance mate. Now, let's see. Hmm. I might be called on. I'm not going to call out any of these guys. I think it's bad luck or something. Um, but uh, I might be called on to do one of these fights. Uh, so I'm looking here. But uh, I'll let someone else make that call. I don't know. Uh, maybe Claire for that, um, uh, Terax, perhaps. Um, might even be Claire for that, um, Vision Arcus up there. Oh, but wait, 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 no. Yeah, because he's, uh, um, yeah. See, he's immune to uh, nullify in this war. So, no, she would not be good for that. Um, so, yeah, we'll, we'll see. We will, we will see how that goes. So, we really do need to win this war. Uh, we are so close to Platinum 3. So, if we can win the next uh, three wars, that would secure us into Platinum 2. Otherwise... We may slip down to Platinum 3. Uh, they're telling me for the first time in a very long time. Uh, it would definitely be the first time since I joined them because uh, I haven't been here that long. Uh, but anyway, 
let's get on with the fighting. All right, so I'm going in with the Overseer, Claire, and Hulkling. Those are the three that I believe are the best for my path and minis. Now, as I said, we need this win um, to even have a chance to stay in Platinum 2. We're at the bottom. We can't afford to uh, lose um, anymore. So this first fight is against Nimrod. And I was not sure whether Hulkling was immune. He's not to um, the power lock. He's immune to power burn not power lock. So he'll still get power locked against uh, Nimrod, but he's still Hulkling. So uh, I'm still hoping he can do this fight uh, without uh, too much difficulty. We don't have to deal with the planetary endurance because he's not a planetary endurance uh, defender. All right. So First thing I want to do is try to build up these pierce. And you can see he's dropping his guard. Finally, he's blocking so that I can hit into his block and get those pierce buffs up. And then, bam. Look at look at the damage. Look at this. And I'm blocked. You know, I'm power locked. But who cares? All right. And I dexed out of the end of it. But look at the damage. Look at his health. Crazy. Hulkling's a beast. He's good on defense. He's good on offense. Um, it would definitely be between him and Hercules as to who I take to rank five, um, if I can take a rank five up. So next up, we've got Big Daddy Apaco. And I was pretty sure he did not get um, any armor ups. But even if he did, didn't matter. Uh, Hulkling is immune to uh, power burn. So uh, I kind of see what they were doing there. Uh, I've noticed this. They'll mismatch, um, or I should say alternate the defenders. Like they'll have one defender on that gets armor ups. That would have been Nimrod. Then they'll have another one that's just a tough defender. That would be big daddy apaco he doesn't get an armor up so you you basically have to kind of think about what you're going to do now i decided to use hulkling for both fights um fortunately hulkling is capable of doing both fights uh but like um there was there was one war that i had to deal with a mojo and um, was it a super scroll? And those were just very, very difficult to deal with champions where super scroll did benefit from the node. So you kind of had to think about how you were going to handle both of these. Um, and I think that's one of the goals of uh, placing your defense is to make your opponent really have to think about uh, how they're going to attack that defense. You know, you don't want them to look at it and go, oh, that's easy. One guy, bam, he'll wipe it out. You know, like when we were in the lower tiers, I noticed that they would place, uh, they wouldn't ban Gallon, and they would have defenders that got armor ups. Well, that's just Gallon food, you know? Uh, and Big Daddy Apaco goes down. And it did not take Hulkling that long and his health is still looking good. I actually do like Hulkling a lot. He is really, really good. All right. Uh, so the middle wasn't cleared at this time, but I wanted to get those fights done. And uh, we had to wait for it to be cleared. It got cleared. Uh, I don't remember. Um, I think, yeah, it was the same day. I didn't go to bed yet. Um, they got it cleared the same day. I'm looking at the... Uh, time and I get to fight Omega Sentinel now here's the thing Overseer is a subdue attacker that means every hit he has a chance to 
I think, what is it, Nullify um, and his specials can put up uh, like a, a six second or something like that. Um, but you still have to be careful. So that's why I did a, a advanced power boost so that I could immediately go right into a special. All right, and you see I'm hitting her. I'm trying to do medium light medium, but not really. Um, she seemed to get the armor ups anyway, but I, I'm do I am playing her somewhat uh, the way that I should. Not not quite, but you can see from her armor ups, I'm not giving her tons and tons of armor ups, and I'm baiting out the special to make her lose her armor ups. Oh man, the the overseer is is definitely a beast. I I, I like him so much. Look at this. Look at this. Ugh. And then that glancing, which is very annoying. All right, here we go. We got her to fire that off. I um, punished it. Doom. And she's down. I remember when we first had to deal with her, she wrecked me. Uh, I didn't know anything about her. I didn't know why she was getting all those armor ups. Um, and, and I didn't know why she was, uh, auto blocking me. I didn't know that her armor ups had anything to do with the auto blocking when I first met her. Uh, so I'm just like, uh, now though we got it. So it was, it was a educational experience. Now I had forgotten why I should not bring Claire against Warlock here. And you're going to see why. And this happened before, and I was trying to remember this. All right, so first up, and I had I still had the um, boost on, so I went ahead and fired it off. Okay, really quickly, because I knew I wasn't gonna get too much of a chance to do that later, because he was gonna keep on draining my power. All right, I was able to at least um, nullify his armor up which is going to of course come back but look at my health look at my health he hasn't hit me but watch my health this is why i have to remember not to go in here against him with claire we got him but that's what those fights often look like it's doable but I hate losing all that health and just, man, and, and it, it is, I could change my, my, um, uh, masteries to avoid it somewhat, but eh, you get that. All right. So that was it for my participation in this war. We'll be back and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war. We really needed this win, okay, to have a chance to stay in Platinum 2. Uh, and these guys were fighters, all right? The, the, as you can see from the score, it was a close, close war. Um, but we got them in the end. All right, so that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. If you want to help me out, it does help me out, helps me grow, helps me get the word out about my videos. Uh, I found out a lot of people don't even know uh, about my videos. Anyway, uh, take care, and you all have a blessed day.